Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the talk Big Ideas, a thought leadership platform to access knowledge, insights and business opportunities for the entire ecosystem of business and entrepreneurship. My name is Anmol Garg. I am the founder of a sales training company called Sales 5X. And today I'm going to be in conversation with an enterprise business leader, Mr. Mahendra Tiwari, head IoT cloud and SaaS at Tata Tele Business Services. Welcome, Mr. Mahendra. Hi. Great to have you here. Thank uh, you. We are going to get from you big ideas on empowering and enabling enterprises to be a leader in their respective domains. So are you ready for this round? Oh, sure, Anmol. I, I always uh, appreciate the energy level of yours, Anmol. I'm sure you are going to shoot <laughs> some really tough questions at me. I'm absolutely ready for that. Great. Love that energy as well. Uh, these are questions which have been bothering a lot of SMEs, business owners. And here's my first question that's coming your way. What is the biggest challenge in B2B businesses at the moment? Uh, I think it is a very relevant question, and Anmol. The world we are living in is constantly aligning and realigning itself. As business models are getting reimagined, there is an emerging need for solutions which are flexible and can enable operations beyond boundaries. You know that, Anmol, there has been a fundamental shift in the business ecosystems, dominated by remote working culture, which has pushed enterprises to reboot their business models. We have been closely witnessing digital reawakening, wherein enterprises have now realized that digital is not just good to have, but an absolute imperative for their survival, growth, and market leadership. Great. I love the use of the phrase uh, digital reawakening. I think it's so important for each one of us to realize how important you know, and crucial it is at this moment. So can you share the idea of this ICS vertical and how it is empowering B2B enterprises? We understand the burgeoning demands of hybrid workforce and enterprises looking for work from anywhere kind of solution. Why work, work from home only, right? A lot of people have traveled down to their home locations. So work from anywhere, but the only challenge is boundaryless offices. Remote working is widely accepted, would continue post-pandemic as well. Our job is to ensure that we provide solutions that, are, that can enable employees working from remote locations in the most safest and efficient manner, giving all possible, possible solutions like remote access for voice, data, collaboration, with far enhanced data security options to keep data safe while being accessed on vulnerable networks. Sure, you spoke about uh, employees working from home and a lot of people are doing it these days. What kind of enterprise solutions can enhance that productivity? Because sometimes it's difficult to get lost. What kind of enterprise solutions can make it more productive? I can say there are plenty. IECS, I stands for IoT. There we offer a variety of LBS solutions, which stands C stands for cloud and collaboration. We currently offer our own private cloud offering to the enterprise customers of ours with a couple of very exciting collab solutions. S stands for software as a service. Apart from these, there are a host of other hosted solutions. We are continuously strengthening our suite of work from anywhere solutions, which can ensure that employees are efficiently working from their respective places. Solutions like hosted IVR that allow enterprises to quickly set up distributed call centers and enable agents to work from home. Others like hosted PBX, audio web conferencing solutions, international bridging services, ensure connectivity and collaboration amongst teams which are geographically spread across the globe. We have also recently introduced SmartFlow, which truly defines our vision of product innovation that empowers enterprise to do big. Do big, you know, it's a, it's a forum, we keep on running it. So whatever products we go ahead and launch, we put a caption, do big. SmartFlow is an anytime, anywhere, flexible suite of cloud communication. It optimizes connectivity, helps in building operational resilience, and enable businesses to deliver better customer experience across channels. As we are into this pandemic situation, we have been witnessing cyber attacks like phishing, ransomware, etc., which have become more, far more pervasive and sophisticated, especially during the time of pandemic. The challenge becomes magnified with employees working from home as it turns the assets more vulnerable 
to cyber threats like phishing the recent increase in phishing spoofing spyware man in middle distributed denial of services data breach ransomware attacks bruce force attacks trojan have made it imperative for enterprises to up- update rather upgrade their cyber security infrastructure to safeguard their sensitive data and business interest there are host of hosted services what we have been offering to our clients sure a lot of action has been happening here and uh, so how is tata tele services playing the role of a growth enabler for its clients i think that's a very very important uh, space for us ttbill has been instrumental in providing best in class global technologies and innovative solution to its clients our customers are now relying on aggressive use of these dig- digital tools what we spoke about to communicate with their employees customers for providing access to reliable applications and services that they require we have seen a significant adoption of cloud based solutions collaboration solutions ai and iot data management solutions that allow enterprises to integrate secure manage their data efficiently we understand that there's a there's a dire need of uh, capex uh, light and asset light solutions we have been working on capex and asset light uh, solution and boosting their productivity while being managed remotely with minimal human interven- interventions great so what would your strategy be you know which can enable enterprises to be a leader in their respective domains i think very important thing is how can we go ahead and educate about the technologies which are available in the market more important is all these technologies may not be uh, i can say uh, fruitful for customers it it depends upon segment to segment so we are working on educating our customers and running quite a lot of awareness programs like business continuity programs do big forums focused towards helping businesses to understand the newer technologies and solutions our objective is to help them to execute optimum risk mitigation strategies to face current pandemic or future crises and stand to emerge out stronger than their than their competition the emerging future of work as we can clearly see is being driven by a network economy that is defined by cost efficiency digital agility and trust sure and what do you think are effective ways of collaboration to connect and engage uh with the clients we have been doing lot of programs which is uh, programs run by taratelli services itself and third party programs like what we have been doing our objective is how can we pass on the information to the customers so that they understand what all technologies which is currently available there are a lot of collaboration solutions which are available you know that webex is there teams zoom right there are tons of such collaboration tools which are available every tool may not be uh, handy or probably good for organization you need to understand which is good for my kind of an organization considering the overall value chain of mine that is very very prudent for organization to understand choosing those technologies is very very critical and we are trying to help all these organization through this uh, webinars or one on one interaction programs what we keep on doing it with the clients sure these were great insights mahendra thank you so much for sharing this and thank you so much for taking time out from your busy schedule and joining us i'm sure all the sme leaders who are watching this would have gained a lot of insight in terms of how do we mitigate these challenges how do we uh, use the suite of tools you know to further be more digital be reawaken i'm still stuck with that phrase and i think i'm going to take that back for a long time to come thank you again mr mahendra for joining us